The end of year recipe we're going to be putting together here is going to be none other than a chocolate covered strawberry martini for the women. I'm going to say that right now, but it's probably going to be for us anyways. We're going to be starting off with a colander about two thirds full of ice. We're going to start with a nice even pour, roughly two ounces. We're going to call it two ounces of some rainbow sherbet rum. I think that's vodka actually. We're also going to do an equal pour of strawberry shortcake vodka. Cream de cocoa. We're going to put a nice one to two ounce dollop in that. It's going to give it a nice little chocolatey flavor. And then we're going to top it off, fill it about two thirds of the way up with half and half cream or whatever your uh, milky whatever is. So we just fucked that up, but that's okay. Because now we're going to prep the glasses while that sits for a few minutes. We're going to take some dark chocolate. We're going to make it all pretty. We want to throw some designs in here. Fabulous. I'm going to set that aside. Let's even, yeah, I'm just babbling on, but that's fine. We're going to throw our garnishes on now because once this thing gets poured, it's going to get ugly. I can tell you right now. Off. Put those in there just in case we make a mess. I like it it's nice and hard. Give it a nice shake. So you feel your hands starting to stick to the side of the metal. You know it's getting cold then. Let's see if we got a good froth going. Let's see how we did on our pour. Let's see if everyone's going to be happy. And it's creamy, and it's frothy, and it's chocolatey, and it's strawberry. Chocolate powder, pure cocoa, right on top. Give it a little dusting. Gives it a little, a little bouquet when you're sipping it. And there we have two chocolate-covered strawberry martinis. This year's fabulous beverage. Now carry one up closer to the screen, to the lens.